Hello and welcome to my channel Organizing Helps. In today's video, I'm going to decorate my Christmas tree and if I have enough time, rest of my house for Christmas. I don't I don't decorate too much, uh, but uh, just a little bit and I enjoy the process. So uh, I would like to share everything with you, starting with the decorating process and uh, finishing with uh, little tips and tricks that I use during decoration. Also, I want to declutter my Christmas decor and it's a perfect time to do that. So if I'll have enough time to do it in this video, I'll share that with you too. My husband helped me to put three together. This year we had to order a new tree stand because our old one broke. So from the start I straightened the branches and fluffing them. I used kitchen rubber gloves to protect my hands from scratches, dryness and dust. I concentrated on the front side of the tree because back is against the wall and I don't decorate that part as we don't see it. Of course, if your tree is seen from all the sides, you have to decorate it all around. Also, I had a little helper during all the process. My little doggy always accompanies me. Before I start decorating, it is important to connect all the lights and check if they are in working condition. My Christmas tree is pretty. It was given to us from family member about 6 years ago, and most of the lights are still working. I heard a lot of bad feedbacks about pre-lit trees because lights are burned after first year. I guess we were lucky. I decorate Christmas tree and the rest of my house except outdoors in traditional Christmas colors, red and gold. I use basic tree ornament and I like to place them by two. I find it gives a little charm and I enjoy the look. I just combine red and gold ornaments of the same size and hang them over the tree evenly. I use two colors ornament but different sizes, small, medium and large. Always place the biggest ornament first and complement them with the smallest. To give Christmas tree different texture and make it look more interesting, I use different type of branches. Every year I try to figure out when it's better to place those type of accessories, in the beginning of decoration or later, but I'm not sure there is correct way to do it. I found that decorating Christmas tree is a very relaxing activity, some kind of meditation, of course if you have enough time to do that. Also this year I bought red and golden feathers for my DIY project and I had leftovers that I added on my tree. I add golden bows and a small and big red flowers and of course the star on the top of the tree. Because the tree is placed close to the stairs it was very easy for me to place the star on top. Adding some red berries to fill up empty spaces. Cover the tree stand with the tree skirt and for now I leave it as it is. But maybe next week I will wrap empty boxes as a gift and place them under the tree. I will share it with you but not in this video. To decorate the piano in the living room, I used snowy jars with the LED candles. It looks so cozy in the evenings. I fill the big glass with the leftovers ornament and add family of snowmen and it's done. The 
This is the first time I decorate kitchen cabinet door with a red ribbon and a bow. I saw pictures on Pinterest how people decorate each cabinet door like this, but I found it looks too much for me and I like the idea, so I decorate only one corner door. I fix the ribbon with tape and attach the bow to the ribbon with the wire ties. You can also glue the bow to the ribbon. It was easy to do and I like how it looks. I changed the spoon rest for a holiday one and the kitchen is done. I like to keep minimal decor in my kitchen. All year round, I have red throw pillows on my couch. I just wash them to refresh the look. In the bedroom, I remove fold decor and place frame that I made previously and add some LED candles, just to have a touch of holiday. In the last for today, I decorate my front porch, hang the wreath on the door and the lights on the tree. I decorate the tree with a little star on top and my DIY pine cone ornaments. If you are interested to check how I made them, you can follow the link in the description box or click on suggested video in the end of this video. My house is ready for Christmas holidays now. If you enjoy this type of video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.